Hey guys, right, first at home workout. Um, so what we're gonna do today, um, we're gonna do two parts. First part, part A, we're gonna work some kind of hinging motions, some single leg work, a bit of glute work as well, and some midline. So I want you to hit four sets, I think I said. Yeah. Yeah, we'll go with that. Look at, look at what was posted of um, three movements, okay? So the first thing four we're sets. gonna do, four sets. Four sets. First thing we're gonna do is um, 10 single leg Romanian deadlifts each leg. Yes. Nailed it. Okay, so single leg Romanian deadlift from here, head yourself onto one leg, slight bend through the knee. Now we're gonna hinge back with our hips, almost think working in a pendulum kind of fashion. I'm getting a stretch through this hamstring and standing up again. 10 repetitions on one leg, 10 on the other, trying to have a stable knee avoiding that knee collapsing in and that ankle collapsing in. If you're feeling good and stable, I went to get some groceries today because of all the uncertainty. They're in my bag here. Here's a weight I can use. I can hold it in one hand. From there, I can apply load to the movement. Boom, 10 each leg. As soon as I've done that, I'm gonna head into some glute bridge holds. I'm gonna go single leg. You could use both legs if single leg's a bit hard. So, I'm gonna put a bit of weight on. I'm gonna use my trusty grocery bag again. From here, onto one leg. I want the knees to be almost in line. From here now, drive your hips up nice and high. Count to 10 seconds, control back down. Repeat again, count to 10 seconds, control back down. One more time, up we go, count to 10, come back down. Then change legs. Finish that bad boy off with a nice plank hold, okay? We're gonna try and go for a nice duration, squeeze the glutes, lock the rib cage in until you feel fatigued in the midline. You don't want that midline to break. So you set yourself for a nice period of time, come off, shake it off. We're gonna compete that for four rounds. Or you know, let's play around at this between 10 or 15 minutes, depending on what time you've got. Then if you wanna get uh, a bit of a pump through on the upper body, get a bit sweaty as well, we're gonna head ourselves over to do some pushes and some pulls. So um, we're gonna post you up kind of different ways you can look at doing rows. One way that I've definitely done on park benches and also um, at home at my dinner table is basically setting up your dinner table as a row station. Uh, so imagine this is a table here guys, like so. Clear the chairs out of the way. If you can do, head to the end of the table. Now, once you're at the end of the table, you take your hands onto the edge of the table, get yourself set up, and from there you're going to pull yourself up to the table, back down again, pulling up and back down. Depending on how hard that is, scale your reps on your workout. What was the total suggested? 150, 150 body weight rows. 150 body weight rows, but I'm looking for you to get that done in sort of, at least at the start, sets of 10 to 15 reps. So if that's going to be difficult, scale the reps down to below 10, but also scale the overall amount down. So you're only doing sort of maximum 10 sets on this if you have the time for that. Every time you have to come off this, because you've got a bit of a pump on through your back and you're fatigued through the arms, you're going to come down, you're going to hit a big set of push-ups as well. Okay? So when I was putting this together, I was thinking I'd try and do 20 push-ups in between each set of rows. I'm just going to keep pinging it through until I get to 150 rows. That's part A and part B, guys. Then, let's cool ourselves down. Let's give ourselves four minutes in total, two minutes each leg to hit a nice deep pigeon pose. Loosen off the glutes and the lower back. From here, drop that knee down. Really stretch through that position. Get a nice stretch through the glutes back here. If you're feeling good, you can drop that chest down a little lower and a little lower again. Think about the breathing. Nice, slow exhale. And just relax into that stretch. Cool, after that, we're all done guys. First at home session done. Have a great evening.